Hey fellas, I just wanted to acknowledge everyone that participated in the September challenge. Uh, this was an idea back in August that I wasn't sure it was going to make a difference, but you guys uh, did far outperformed what I was sort of expecting. Um, so in total, uh, there were 906 instances of mental load that were identified over the month. Um, there are about 28 different participants. Um, the high score was 120, technically 177 with bonuses, um, which I actually needed for a tiebreaker. Um, so the top 10 names, I'm just going to read out loud here. Uh, 31 points, David Locke. Uh, 34 points, Eduardo Martinez. 36 points, Christian Van Wick. 38 points, Brian Schul Schoenberger. Um, 39 points, Mike Macchiarelli. 60 points, Helmuth Cody. 70 points, Ryan Muscott. 104 points, Joshua Nelson. 120 points were tied for first place. Ben Blaney and David Pearl had a perfect month. The tiebreaker is going to go to Mr. Blaney as he, in a handful of his posts, went overboard and scored way more um, points than the four, um, which were all put into the bonus. I counted about 57 total additional ones. So um, the final score with bonuses as that is the tiebreaker uh, come out, came out to 177 uh, to 130. So congratulations, Ben. I'm going to be speaking with you about how we're going to get your $200 for your date night. Um, and let's talk about the October challenge. So I decided it's going to go 21 days rather than the full month. I think people start to fall off and feel like they can't catch up um, after the last week. Uh, participation significantly went down uh, in the last last week and a half or so for most people. So it's going to be a 21 day challenge, October 1st through October 21st. We're reversing it. Um, you are identifying the mental load that you own in your home. So uh, if all the things that you identified that your partner does, this time we're doing it for ourselves. Also, I'm adding a bonus. If you refer someone even just to the free program, um, that is, you get an extra 20 points. So you can score up to four a day, but you can consistently multiply. Um, the only thing you got to do is people need to introduce themselves and say, hey, my name is blah, blah, blah. This person, um, so-and-so referred me to join this group in this challenge. So you get an extra 20 points for every new person that jumps in because of you. I'm also opening this up to partners. So if your wife, if your girlfriend, if your fiance, um, if you it wants to jump in and acknowledge you for the mental load that you own, they can join too. And again, I would recommend have any and all people that you want into mental load basics. Um, we surpassed my goal for the month, which is to get 100 people in, in the free community. Um, I would really like to pass 300. So adding another 200 people, I know most of you saw one of my emails or saw one of my videos, um, but I'm hoping that a couple of you are going to take advantage of it. So not only, because I, I think it takes some courage to invite people to jump into the challenge. Um, so that's why there's a significant bonus. So it could be the person that refers the most people in, um, bring your, your network of people in, but I think having them know what they're getting into, I think um, takes some courage and that in itself will spark tough conversations that you'll be doing similar work to doing the work of identifying your own mental load. And what I anticipate is there's going to be a lot more moments of uh, domestic labor, physical labor is being called out when in fact it's mental load that we're aiming for and trying to identify. So I'm looking forward to the October challenge, see how this goes. And uh, I wish you guys luck again. Um, looking forward to seeing where things go and you guys can, you guys can anticipate usually within a week, I will respond to and score up the points and add to the leaderboard and update it. Happy hunting. Uh, look forward to seeing how you guys do.